Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Virgo. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of January. So January 2021. This is being recorded way before January 2021 because I figured it'd be good for us to have a preview of what's to come. So let's just see what we have for Virgo for January 2021. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're going to start right here. What do we have for Virgo for January 2021? Oh, we got two. We're going to have to take them both. Two of Cups and the Hermit, which is totally this is totally the opposite because this is a union this is solitary so you will probably be doing one or the other you may be coming into union or going into solitude so it's going to be that much of a change so if you've been in solitude you're going into uh, spiritual union. If you've been in a union, you're probably going into solitude. Okay, so that's what it looks like. Now, this is uh, the hermit is about, be which is you. Okay, that's you. So you are, you're going to be uniting with somebody by the looks of things. And that's what I think this is. I feel like you have mastered something. I feel like you've become consciously awake. If you are already in a relationship right now, you may be deepening that bond, okay? Um, I feel as though you're realizing your true identity, and it does involve a spiritual union of some sort, okay? I think that you have become consciously aware you've gone through some sort of awakening, or you're going through it now. But you are going to be um, working with another person. That's what it looks like to me, um, which is interesting. This is really, really interesting. You may be also realizing that, you know, it feels like the spiritual, there's a lot of self-love here. There's a lot of self-love, and I feel like this self-love is what brings you together with perhaps the perfect match. I feel like this twos are about choices. You may come together with somebody that you weren't expecting if you're single. Okay, say you're single. Or even if you're in a relationship now. I mean, you may come together with somebody that you feel a deep, deep, deep connection with, and you're going to need time to reflect on your choice. Okay, you feel this connection. It's deep. It's definitely deep. And you need to obviously make a choice. You need to make a choice. This may be about giving up independence. You know, maybe, maybe you've been, some of you have been independent. Maybe you're in a relationship now and somebody wants to get married. You know, that's a question of independence, you know. So this is, this month, I think that you are going to be questioning your independence or you're going to be deepening a bond with somebody. Um, it's like the bond is just going to get stronger and stronger and stronger. So I'm not sure how that resonates with you, but I do see a spirit, <laughs> well, you're going to have a hard time. You are going to have a hard time with this choice by the looks of things um so let's get one of these you're going to need time to think about this union take all the time you need in making a choice you're going to be making some sort of choice in regards to love okay so what do we have for Virgo?
actions speak loudly. Express your love through actions. So you probably will be expressing your love <laughs> by the looks of things. Um, other per another person's action actions are going to be showing here. Um, I do see a beautiful connection. I see a, it's this is like kindred spirits. This is a overflow of emotion as well. So I feel like you're definitely going to need time to think about a connection that has come to be. Maybe you weren't looking for it. That's what it looks like to me. You weren't even looking for this connection. But whoever you're dealing with is really, or you, some it could be you, somebody is, is really putting in a lot of effort, put it that way. So what do we have for Virgo for January? The Empress. Okay, so the Empress is a creator. She's a creator. She's motherly. She's domestic. She's a natural. Uh, this is a time of incubation. This is the birth of a new life. Okay, you are you are birthing a new life as we speak. For some of you, this could be getting pregnant if you're at childbearing age. It could be getting pregnant. Um, it's definitely a very fertile time for love and abundance. Because she is the queen of a love of love and abundance. For some of you, you could be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra, but this could also be your energy. Okay, it could be. This is uh, having plenty. This is all about love and unconditional love, being loved and cared for. So this is about tender love and care. This is a very beautiful individual who creates everything with love, and is is sought after. You know. Um, ooh, Ace of Cups reversed. There could be tears. There could be some tears over, you know, whatever is happening it may be overwhelming to you. You may feel overwhelmed. You may want to, uh, you're going to need to control your emotions, put it that way. I feel like you may, you may be emotionally blocked and you need to open your heart I feel like whoever you're dealing with is very, very loving, okay? If this isn't you, if this is a very loving individual that can create happiness, can create, you know, abundance. This is the birth of a new life, but it's a very emotional. There's going to be some tears. This is tears. This is sadness of some sort emotional shutdown or can't master emotions this could be i don't know let's get one more card there's definitely going to be some tears that are shed justice justice so there's some sort of final decision you're going to have to make a decision based on facts based on truth it's going to be very emotional you're definitely going to be making a decision this month it may be involving a libra maybe you have some libra in your chart um but justice is about things going in your favor, getting what you deserve, bringing balance to your life. Balance is coming to your life. You are about to get some sort of, whatever's happening is going to work out in your favor. You're getting something that you deserve, but it's going to be very, very emotional. Okay, I don't think you're going to be able to, to master your emotions. These could be like tears of joy or something like that that's kind of like what it feels like to me I feel like it's tears of joy you're just gonna be it feels like I wouldn't be surprised if we had the tower because I feel like it's shock I do I feel like it's shock I feel like uh, um, you're gonna need to be honest with yourself you're gonna have to uh, honor your truth okay you're going to be making a difficult decision this month. It has to do with a partnership. Uh, there Maybe there was a rejection in the past. This could be a rejection. Um, oh my goodness gracious, Virgo. Two of Cups again. So you got Two of Cups twice. Okay. And, and the Justice card. So this is this is a union. This is a this is a partnership. This is love. This is compatibility. This is a potential soulmate. It really is. 
So you're going to have to make a choice in regards to uh, whether you want to uh, create a new life with this person or not. Whoever you are coming together with um, is going to be honest. They're going to be telling you the truth. Whatever they're saying to you is very uh, genuine. Okay, this, Whoever you are dealing with is genuine. They generally, genuinely have feelings for you. and I, But I feel as though they feel a spiritual, you have a spiritual connection with this person. But this Ace of Cups is tears. It's tears. It's sadness. Maybe there was, I think there was a previous rejection because of this. I mean, now we got the Page of Cups in reverse on the bottom. I think there's been, there was some sort of rejection here. This is somebody that either you rejected in the past or they rejected you. Now there's an opportunity to I don't know. Maybe it's rekindle. Could be somebody brand new, though. It could be somebody brand new. Don't rule that out. The Six of Wands is somebody that is is has already been through a battle. This person is going to take action. So this is somebody that has uh, already suffered. Okay, has already been through. You know, the battle zone. This person is all done fighting. They're all done playing games. They are ready to settle down. So whoever you are with wants to settle down. They're going to prove it to you. They're going to prove it to you. So um, this is a warrior. Somebody that will protect you. That wants to protect you. This person is, is coming in. Um, they've been urged by their friends or their family or whatever. They have, they've been urged to follow their heart. That one just fell out, but, and I haven't seen it yet. So anyway, they've been urged to follow their heart, but they haven't been able to. Maybe they were fearing rejection. Whoever this person is, this, this empress is somebody that is a giver of life. She's been in some sort of pain, or she experiences pain. She delivers. She delivers miracles. She delivers blessings. She has plenty. She takes care of everybody with love. Everybody wants her. Everybody sees her beauty. She's absolutely glowing. She's abundant. She's independent. She takes care of business. Mm. Temperance reverse. You may not be ready for this. I'm not sure you are. You may not be ready. You may be. You may feel like it's bad timing. You may feel, or whoever you, that is coming in maybe wasn't ready. You know, maybe maybe they were in an unbalanced uh, mindset before, or they were going overboard, or they were engaging in negative patterns, and uh, they needed to do some self healing. I feel like uh, whoever, because it's right here before this person coming in. It's the person coming in. The person, or it's you, it could be you. There's been some unbalanced emotions here. Some, and there's been some, some inappropriate behavior. Somebody may have had some addictions that hindered them from taking action. You know, and it may have been fears even. So somebody was fearful of taking action. Maybe, maybe they uh, <sighs> weren't grounded, you know, or they were too wishy-washy, you know, they, they needed to balance the, the, uh, their emotions, but, and I think that they are now, now they're able to balance their emotions, but in the past, they weren't able to, they're, it's almost like they were fighting themselves, um, so we have somebody, and they probably buried themselves in some sort of addictions, they went overboard, somebody went overboard engaging in negative patterns, and now they're done, now they're done, Okay, they've learned some sort of lesson by doing so, and now they're ready. They're ready to uh, commit to a relationship. They're ready to commit to a union. They're ready to do whatever it takes to bring balance or to do the right thing or act with integrity or whatever it is. You definitely have somebody here that is, uh, this is a warrior. This is a protector that is, is 
that has learned some sort of lesson, now they've re-examined And it feels like they're they're headed in your direction or they're going to put in a lot of effort. I feel like this is somebody that is willing to fight for you. They're willing to do whatever it takes. They're willing to do whatever it takes to bring balance to this partnership. So somebody is really going to uh I feel like it's a shock. I feel like they're going to they're going to surprise you. They're going to surprise you. Um they're really going to do whatever it takes to prove their prove that they want to protect you, you know, um, that they, that they love you. Somebody loves you. Death reversed. Whew. So death reversed. That is a new beginning, but there's been a delay. There has been a delay. I feel like there's been some sort of incident that has ended for this person that taught them a lesson. We do have an individual that has been held back by fear. They've been in a period of indecision. They've been imbalanced. They've been holding on to that fear. They've been holding on to their own ego. Okay, they have. They've been holding on. Their, their ego has gotten in the way of their happiness. It has. But now, now they just want to win. They just want to win. This person is all done. They do not want to fight anymore. They don't want to. They don't want to play games. They're ready to let go of their ego because they want this union. Somebody wants a union with you. Um, or you want a union with them. This could go vice versa. So if you're the cross watcher, this reading could be for you. I do feel like we have an individual here that is going to do, they're going to tell the truth. They're going to do whatever it takes to bring balance, because we have a lot of balance here, to bring balance to a partnership. They feel a very strong connection and they don't want to let it go they don't want to let it go okay they don't want the connection to die the connection is too strong anyway i don't think the connection is going to die because it's like that quote oh god i read it just today too um what is meant to be will always come will always come to you or will always come back to you whatever it is and that wasn't the exact words of the quote because i can't remember it but this is meant to be this is a union that is absolutely meant to be, okay? It's, it's, it is. So I believe that you are going to come together with somebody that uh, you are in alignment with. You are in alignment with this person. Uh, when you look at this person, you know that they are the one. I think that it's going to be very uh, heartfelt. I think it's going to be very emotional. I feel as though somebody coming back, I, because of this Wheel of Fortune reverse, this is like somebody coming back around. Um, I feel like uh, this person, this is the queen of value here. The queen. Of, this is the queen of all queens. She's the queen of value. Okay, she knows her value. And whoever this person is, sees your value. They see your beauty. And they're going to prove it. They're going to prove that they are not going to let you down. They're really going to put in a lot of action. I feel like it is the masculine that is, is, is putting in the action. I feel like we have this beautiful woman. And yes, I believe the Empress is a woman. And I, don't, I understand about masculine and feminine. But I'm telling you that I feel like we have a woman here that is a blessing. That knows her value. That has been waiting She's been waiting, okay? She's been waiting for, for her gift. She's been waiting for her blessings to arrive. Here they come. This is a blessing. This is a hero. This is a warrior. This person is going to do whatever it takes to prove They're going to tell the truth, too. This person is honest. They are truthful. And that they love. They're going to prove that they love you. So whoever this is, I do not know. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. You could be dealing with... Now, this, this Sagittarius could be in the past. That could be the lesson. Okay? It doesn't have to be a Sagittarius. But you see, it's behind. It's behind. So this is, like, behind you. Okay? So could be a Libra, could be Taurus, could be a Libra already. Um, we could have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. 
Either way, get ready for justice to be served in your favor this month. If you are going to court for anything, it's going to go out. It's going to go in your favor. If you're signing any contracts, it's going to go in your favor. Um, you need to let go of your fear. Okay, you need to let go of your fear of, of love. Let go of your fear of love. Get get get. Let go of your fear of uh, partnerships, of falling in love. Because this is falling in love. This is deepening a bond. But fear... You need to let go of fear. No fear. No fear. Yes, I understand that there's pain here. But at the end of pain is a blessing. Okay? Endings lead to new beginnings. So I do believe that there's a, there's a beautiful new beginning here that you probably did not anticipate. And you may not even be ready for it. Or the person that you're dealing with may be shocked. They may not be ready for it. I feel like this is... This is uh, uh, unexpected choice in love put it that way good luck